pieces of the good firewood down to the ATV where we'll drive about three quarters of a mile back to our place um, where our home is. This is just on the other side, on the other side of our property. This is such a pretty place to be working. This one's a big one for us. I just have the 20 inch DeWalt um, and so but with how dry this is, it's actually been doing really good. And we bought an Oregon chainsaw sharpener. And so our blades get sharpened a lot better now. And so that helps me so much. This is such a really pretty place. I really enjoy this place. I'd love to put a cabin or two up there, one down in here. Oh, it's so beautiful. Just so peaceful and quiet. And Oh, it's amazing. It's so awesome to see where the light hits. There's another little pond right there. So right here would be an amazing spot for a little cabin. And then that opens up and that's usually full of water, but we're just in the time in the fall before we get some rain that it will start filling up again. So we're able to get these logs off now. If we wait, um, we'd be able to do it in the snow, but not so fun getting back into here. So right now is a perfect time of year to get some of this wood out of here. There's bear up there. So I'm guessing the two little kids are up there. I hope they're being careful. It scares me to death to have them up there hiking. Oh my gosh. But I gotta be Remember the kind of crazy stuff I did. My parents allowed it. They're just sitting up there petting the dog. That's what childhood should be, right? The joy in the mountains. The peace and quiet. This is so interesting. Um, this thing rotted and fell on the ground. But look at all this good wood. I mean, that's like prime. That's as good as it gets. Started rotting there, but it's still good there. And so far up to there, it's been great. So I'm gonna try to get, I only have one battery left. So we're gonna try to finish. Oh, did he find a leg? Yeah. Mountain lion or something got to it. So we got the big one cut up there. And um, we'll get in this one. See there, there's a lot of small ones, but I'm not gonna haul those off the mountain. And then, um, anyways, that'll be good for now. Our trail cam's right. I think it's actually, yeah, we're too far this way. Oh my gosh, so that's why I was thinking, I think I was in the wrong area. I didn't go far enough this way because now there's more. And that's where our trail cam is, is right there, which is still close to where we're at, but so many trees that are gonna fall. This one right here is about to fall. I was gonna see if I could push it over. When Ty gets back, I'm going to see if he can, anyways, see if we can fall that one right there. I think it should be okay. Um, anyways, it looks like it'll just come out or I'll just leave it and let it fall in the next windstorm because it's pretty rotted out. So, our little path. Look at the deer's path or the wildlife's path. Lots of fighting going on. What are you doing over here? Lots of helpers. And we got a dog. 
I found a found a poor deer leg. Not sure if the bears killed the deer or if it was the mountain lion. It was found over on my walking trail when we came back from knee surgery and there was lots of deer poop around or bear poop around. He's having a great time. Bear, you love that? Hey boy!